What is the most important problem in your field? This is a question I've been obsessing over ever since reading about the hamming question the first time. They found a commonality that most people that were eating lunch with hamming went on to do some of the most fundamental research and eventually leading uh, Nobel Prizes. What Hamming was so surprised by was how few of the scientists were actually pursuing the most important problems in their field. So when I was thinking about doing, doing something next, I was thinking about what is the most important problem in computer science. And what I concluded was that learning is the world's most important problem. And why learning is so incredibly important is because everything starts with learning. It's a meta problem of sorts. So if we just solve learning, we will solve everything else. Let's take an example. If we want to solve the transition to renewable energies, we need to train millions of solar panel installers and the teams that, that are driving this research forward to subsequently drive that change. Or if we want to accelerate the development of new medicines, that starts about training the researchers and engineers that are driving this, these fields forward. However, when we look at this discipline, most of the knowledge that we have today is stuck in ancient formats and spread across dozens of different tools. So what we asked ourselves with SANA is, how could we reimagine learning with an AI-first approach to make the learning experience entirely personalized? To even automatically create content based on your exact level and exactly what you need to know? And today, we're introducing SANA Assistant. It's the next chapter in that story, and we're so excited to put it in your hands. SANA Assistant starts, starts with the search. You can connect all of your company's apps, whether that's Slack, Salesforce, Google Drive, anywhere where you have information stored. And then, through SANA Search, you can query that knowledge in under 100 milliseconds. Even an all-hands or a one-on-one you had in the past, everything in SANA Search is automatically recorded and transcribed, and you can get to that exact nugget of information that you're looking for. But what's most interesting is, when the search result isn't there, SANA can automatically create content addressing your specific query. So whether that is addressing a specific course and automatically generating that on your specific level, or creating a quick summary so you can get the exact answer you need, SANA creates that automatically for you. And in SANA, all of this content is automatically generated using a new element, which we call cards. These cards can be everything from interactive polls and reflection cards to videos and narrations. So not only is this content being automatically generated, but it's being generated in whole new interactive formats that can engage learners to a whole new level. But if you don't want to just publish that content immediately, Sun allows you to edit that in a multiplayer editor where you can create content together with your colleagues before you hit publish. And using recent breakthroughs in generative AI, Sana will even generate images on, based on these topics that are on the brand. So understanding your, your company's tone of voice, understanding your company's brand, understanding exactly what you're looking to, to learn, Sana can automatically generate this content for you. But not only does Assistant create this content, but it also allows you to automate actions. So you can ask the, the Assistant to, for example, assign courses, roll them out at certain due dates, and it will automatically organize and roll out all of the content that you've produced in, 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 in SANA. What this is creating for you is an institutional knowledge base. So all of your company's knowledge, whether that's in Q&A, live recordings, all of that content gets automatically indexed, organized, and searchable in, in SANA, and, and building out and capturing all of that company's knowledge. And then when you want to access it, SANA brings that content to wherever you are. So whether you want to search the content through Slack, or if you're already in Salesforce or other systems, 
Sana surfaces that content in real time in the flow of work. And you can set up triggers, so if certain actions happen in Salesforce, you should automatically trigger certain learning elements. And based on all of these different actions, automatically trigger the learning exactly when people need it. So using the latest breakthroughs in ma machine learning, we're really reimagining how knowledge is searched, accessed, created, and subsequently consumed. And over the long run, we think there's an opportunity to build the next generation internet scale library of Alexandria. So looking back at Library of Alexandria, that was a place where you could go to find all human knowledge. That was a place you could go to find question, any, answers to any questions you might have, where it was live tutorials and, and other elements. And using these breakthroughs, we think there's, there's the opportunity to create this next category of learning and knowledge tools. Tools that are entirely personalized to how each one of us learns, that are entirely personalized to how we learn, how we access information, what our level is at, and ultimately allowing us to learn 10 times faster. And what we've seen in the past is that any time we change how humans share and access knowledge, whether that's Library of Alexandria, the printing press, or Google, that has positive cascade effects in every single discipline. So with AI, we think there's an opportunity to ultimately solve the most important problem in our field, which is how do we empower humans to get the knowledge they need to ultimately achieve their respective missions. So that's all about SANA, and we're really excited to be introducing uh, SANA Assistant today. So go to the website if you want to try it out for yourself and share and access the world's knowledge. Thank you so much.